What started out as a class project at a college in Nevada has turned into a national touring exhibit of the Iraq War. And its first stop is in Wisconsin, all because of a woman from Marinette. Kristen Byrne reports. It is so <sighs> intense. Mary Stoudmire first saw these photos from the Iraq War last year when she was visiting family in Nevada. They were part of a display some students put together at Western Nevada College. I looked at the exhibit and it just, it blew me away. It features poetry, but mainly war photos, including all the faces of the soldiers who died in Iraq and Afghanistan. There are more than 5,000 of those photos. After seeing them, Stoudmire asked the Nevada College an important question. I said, what are you going to do with it next? And she said, put it away. I suggested that we would, Marinette, would, we'd, think we'd take it. When she came back home, UW Marinette liked her idea. I think it's a, there's a moral imperative to do this. Uh, when I heard about it a year ago from Mary Stoudmire, I said, we've got to do it. We'll find the money to pay for the shipping and buy the new equipment. It has been emotional for us. Um, unwrapping um, the, the pieces as they come in. There's excitement at the same time as there's a sense of reverence and a sense of the importance of this. So at UW Marinette, starting next Wednesday until the end of October, anyone who wants to come see these images can. Let's remember, let's give reverence to these people. It really brings home, I think, that ultimate sacrifice and personalizes the war. In fact, it will travel to six other UW colleges in our state staying in Wisconsin for a full year. All because Mary Stoudenmeyer saw these faces and knew others needed to do the same. If we don't have a stake in the game, we don't have a, ch a child or a family member or a friend of a family member who's in it, we're not paying attention. We're not, we're, we're, we just gloss over the 30 second sound bites on the news and that's about it. And I felt that this is so important. It makes me feel so proud, it really does. In Marinette, Kristen Byrne, Action 2 News.